Hi all, welcome to my channel, welcome to my world, this is the world of Wayne, and uh, I haven't made a video in over a week, that's just crazy. I've had nothing delivered, no DeLoreans, no R2s, no helmets, no X-Wings, no Marvel figures, I mean, uh, I don't know what's going on, but I'm guessing that the next delivery is probably going to start next week. Uh, but I do get a lot of people asking me, what have I actually got in my man cave, because believe it or not, you only see in like... Well, the back section here, just the Millennium Falcon and the figures. Uh, I've got a lot more in there, so what I've done is I've done this little roll where I've just focused on some of the things I've got in my man cave. Um, some of them are really cool. You'll have to let me know what you think of them. But uh, this is the items I have in my man cave. Okay, well, this is my man cave. Uh, this is the desk I work from, and uh, this is the workstation where you see me building all the uh, Millennium Falcons and... Like swings and stuff like that. Uh, first things first though, the desktops is an animated wallpaper uh, engine which is available on Steam. As you can see I've got some nice beach views and I love running water so uh, that's what keeps me relaxed. This hand solo came with the Millennium Falcon, I believe it was the Millennium Falcon. Um, and here we've got just an assortment of some of my USB dongles, some of the things from Loot Crate and the remotes from my Millennium Falcon and Yoda. The mother-in-law made me this, uh, absolutely brilliant little crocheted Yoda, and there's plenty more in the series of that. Uh, and this I got from the Harry Potter tour in London, it's uh, the Gryffindor mug. Uh, on the windowsill here I've got some Star Wars stills, a uh, little Oscar there, a light up Millennium Falcon and God knows what that R2-D2 thing is, but so I was given that. Uh, and these are my favourite pops from the Karate Kid, Mr. Miyagi, Johnny Lawrence and Daniel LaRusso. Uh, what else have we got? Uh, on top of my computer I have an old Captain America shield that I got from Loot Crate and the uh, Death Star here which is a lamp. You put it in and it lights up, that's plugged into the uh, computer. And the computer I built myself, it's all lit up and stuff. I've changed the colour this morning, it's a nice light blue. Um, but that's my pride and joy. And this is the workstation where I build all of the items. As you can see, I've got the camera set up there. Uh, this is just a uh, word representation of all the Marvel things, making Captain America shield. And the lovely missus made me this for reaching a thousand subscribers on YouTube. It's a bronze play button. <laughs> uh, this is the uh, Elder Wand from the Harry Potter Studio Tour. Uh, £25 those ones are, absolutely massive. And this is the Star Trek experience, which is no longer in Vegas, but I have my picture taken there. Um, there's the Millennium Falcon, finished, on my wall, looking good. And as you can see, it's being reinforced by one hell of an industrial strength uh, clamp there. Uh, a selection of some of my figures, and these are night lights available through Philips. So I've got the Yoda one, and that's a separate one with a hand there. Um... More figures. There's all my Star Wars helmets so far. And as you can see, I need a new shelf at the moment. Um, but there's some more figures. I haven't got the set of the vintage collection. I am missing about 15 figures. The lightsaber is Luke's lightsaber. That's the £100 Force FX one. Um, uh, there's some more night lights there. Force hammer. Uh, Iron Man helmet. The out of time number plate, which comes with a build of the DeLorean. And there's my Marvel movie figurine collection so far. Still waiting for the other shelf. <laughs> Hasn't come yet. And just another little angle of my Star Wars helmets. On the other side there, I've got Captain America's shield, which is the Philips Nightlight. And this is my Pride and Jord and Duriel from Lord of the Rings. Limited edition it is. Uh, I've got something like 2,300 of 5,000. That was all that was made. Um... The Back to the Future poster there was from London Film and Comic Con two years ago. It's a limited edition poster. And the Harry Potter poster will be going soon. Um, this is my katana from Kill Bill. It's a real katana, that one. That's why I put it up high. And on the ceiling, you don't see this in any of my videos. But when I do green screen, I just have a drop-down blackout blind. As you can see, I can pull down behind me. And it gives me my own green screen without having to keep it permanently set up. Keeps it out of the way. So there you have it. I hope you like that little tour of the man cave. Um, obviously there's loads of room to put more stuff in here and I'm going to have to start moving things around to actually cram things in here. Just to make things look a bit more aesthetically pleasing where you're watching my ugly face. Anyway, hope you like that video. Take care.